Really quick, guys, I do have a sponsorship deal here with Messy Modding Store. Uh, pretty much, it's just a store where you can go and buy modded accounts for Red Dead Redemption 2 online or for GTA Online if you're interested in that. And uh, you can also, like for the PC version, you can buy straight up just cash, gold bars, whatever. Uh, and then for the consoles and stuff, you can already you can buy accounts that already have gold bars, you know, already have money, uh, certain levels, whatever, just depending on what you're looking for. And yeah, I'll link this in the description. Uh, you can go ahead and go check it out if you are interested in that. If you're not, that's fine. But yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get into the video. Hey guys, the Better Editor. I'm coming at you guys with a uh, another hotspot video for the game of Red Dead Online. This will be done on PC, but you can do this on any platform. You should be able to at least. And uh, I'm going to be showing you exactly what you're doing. If you guys don't know, this week is Collector Week. So you got... 10 the the collector bowl the collector bowl the collector roll was 10 gold bars instead of the normal 15 that it usually costs so you can go ahead and grab that for a lot cheaper than it normally would be so i would go ahead and pick that up and then also uh there i have a playlist on my channel called rdo hotspots and i'm going to be showing you what you pretty much do with these so essentially i'm going to be showing you man's anita post for today there is a fast travel post right here so you can fast travel straight here uh, unlike a lot of the other ones that I show and uh, pretty much all you do is stand in the vicinity of where a bunch of collectibles would spawn but aren't there and uh, you find a new session and that makes them spawn so we're gonna stand here on this porch and we're gonna find a new session and magically a bunch of collectibles are gonna appear that wasn't there before so I'll get back with you guys in one second alright so we spawned across the road here it doesn't really matter where you spawn as long as you don't spawn halfway across the map. That is a glitch that can happen where you'll spawn like really far away from where you were. So essentially, after we have found that new session, you can come and get all the cards or all the collectibles that spawn. Normally the ones that did spawn from finding a new session won't make a noise like the jingle that it usually makes. And uh, there's one right there that I just grabbed. In this house there's three of them. Uh, the ones that do make the jingle were probably here beforehand. But there is a Tennessee whiskey bottle underneath the cabinet here. Then up on this little log, there is a card. And then under the bed over here, there's a card right here. So already that's four items. There's, I believe, two more that I'm going to be showing you. So uh, we got the one on the table right here, the three in that house. And then there's one on the porch of this house right here. And then to the left, there is another one that we'll grab. So that was our fifth. And then our sixth will be right here on this table. And if you get lucky, there may or may not be a coin behind the house that you can dig up. Uh, you can't force spawn uh, diggables. What the hell? You can only force spawn uh, things that aren't underground. And there is no coin today, unfortunately, the day that I'm recording this. So we can't grab that. This video will come out a couple days after I'm recording it, so you might be able to get lucky and there be a coin behind you, or behind that. Uh, and then also, I don't know, there's like an old exploit you used to be able to do. I don't know if you can still do it. You can like take a horse, sandwich it right here, get off of it, and then uh, pick the saddlebags and then it can't kick you because it's like stuck. <laughs> That's an old timey trick right there might want to give it a shot if you're a very low level or something like that because usually if you try to pick saddlebags you'll just get kicked see watch this I try to get in this saddlebag and I'm not gonna get kicked okay what about this side I gotta get kicked eventually right well never mind I guess these horses up here are just extremely nice huh I don't know well, if you guys did like this video, then give it a like. If you dislike this video, then give it a dislike. If you guys want to see more videos like this, then go ahead and hit the sub button and you will see more. I didn't even notice that. There's grass all over the top of that. Other than all that stuff, if you guys want to see more videos like this... Huh? I think I already said that. Other than all that stuff, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye. <laughs>